Recently, I found myself enthralled with the idea of beating Castlevania Symphony of the Night without killing any of the enemies. Normally, once Alucard enters a boss room, the doors seal shut behind him and there's no way to exit the fight. And in this run, well, I was able to do this. This should work, right? Nice. So yeah, here I was able to skip the death trigger here. Hold it! Clearly, those bosses were killed. They went into their death animation and the game considers them dead. Objection! Actually, if you look closely at the screen, you'll notice that Alucard doesn't actually level up after Slogger and Gaibon die. And Alucard needs 100 experience points to level up from level 1. If Alucard had actually been the one to kill those bosses, he would have gained that experience and the level up animation would have shown up on the screen. What actually happened here is a glitch called a revenge tech. By having multiple projectile hitboxes hitting an enemy at the same time, while Alucard is also inside of that enemy, it won't count as a kill, and the pacifist speedrun is allowed to continue. 